Uh, the auction house Christie's send the catalogue as they usually do to my gallery and I opened the envelope and I flipped through the catalogue and my eye got stuck on this picture because of how it looks but also because they called it Circle of Rembrandt van Rijn and if you know a little bit about uh, the 17th century you can sort of see that this type of fashion relates to the early 30s so at that time Rembrandt just came from Leiden and he had, didn't have a circle. So I thought, what, what they write down doesn't make sense, and the picture looks too good. So it's that sort of blink, in the blink of an eye feeling that I felt this is better than what they think. So Rembrandt, when he paints a portrait, he has two goals. One is to actually depict a sitter, and it should be as realistic as possible. And the other goal is that he can uh, show um, his creativity. And when you paint a face, you, you really have to follow nature. So you can, you can use a certain pose, you can make it slightly interesting, but the real interest lies in, in the fabric, because you can make it elaborate or elegant or quirky or particular. And Rembrandt tries to find, in these, especially in these roughs, he tries to find the position with little angles, with little curves. And there's one fantastic flap of lace, and there is, there's one curved edge and it's so fantastic, it's such a depiction of space that you really want to put your finger under it. And, and the ability to get there to that end result, in my view and in many other experts' view, only Rembrandt ever reached that level. For me, uh, it's about connoisseurship, old-fashioned way of looking at pictures and really having an eye and having the ability to see greatness in paintings. But that's not enough these days. You also have to compare it to technical elements. So we did every potential possible test available. Uh, it's, it's, it's a very exciting day. Uh, we're thrilled to, to have this um, beautiful painting here because yeah, it's once in a lifetime actually that a new art piece of art is, has it's been found and, uh, and now we can share it here with a Dutch public. It's, uh, yeah, that feels good as a museum director because that's what you're doing all day uh, to share art with uh, a public.